Do you want the next one? Yes. Spiritual. Yes, Spiritual. That what and when you said when you went through them, what that one didn't land with me so much. That was like a mm -hmm. well, I don't need to worry about that. Shall I just read it what so there's value clarification, so that'd be your own personal value system. So are you sticking to it? You know, I suppose the conscious part of you know, when you're looking at your conscience, I suppose, are you sticking to like um good human values, I suppose that's sort of commitment, study and meditation, they're the they're the sort of uh four subheadings. We know I had my little dalliance with some meditation probably a couple of years ago in fact now joe probably more than a couple of years ago in fact it's way back in the archive people you can hear it in quite a, i'm going to say it must be an episode in the 30s 40s somewhere that sort of range i would hazard a guess I and mean, i see the benefits of it and there's things we you know we've talked to in another podcast my kind of drive in time after doing some odd jobs and your creative brain starts to kick in and all that all that sort of stuff so i think i do that self-awareness bit i don't yeah it just it doesn't land with me under the banner of spiritual but i know what the things are that you're you're kind of referring to there but that's probably i think whether it's true or if it's perception i'd say that's probably a weaker area of the development something that probably needs a bit of focus if i was going to do that yeah because you're talking about meditation someone said something to you i think it was an early podcast about meditation and you're talking about something you tried it and you quite liked it um what was it i can't remember what it was um, you got me to do it. I did it during the recording. Yeah, I you came did back it. in the I room just, and I was sure someone else said, sort of said, some, said something to you. Like in the, I think it's in the moment stuff, actually. That's probably where I'm trying to go with it. The in the moment stuff. You know what you're talking about? The, or the mindfulness you know, type like of thing. Yeah. Mindfulness, that's yeah. it. So so I, so what from what you said in the previous, that's where I think it sits with you at the that's minute. True, that's true, yeah. And that is something I'm conscious Because that is like. that intrinsic reflection is in the moment. It's it's pretty spiritual because you're tapping into that in the moment, living in the moment, being in the moment, knowing where you are, knowing where you sit. So anyway, so I'll let you expand on that. No, I agree. That that's, might that's, something that's, triggered. Oh, I've got a, I've got a Lee echo coming through, Joe. Back away from oh. your microphone. Oh, I've not done anything. No. Oh. There we Is go. Is that better? Oh no, I'm still there. No, that's better. Is that better? better? I may have to be closer, possibly. I may have to be closer. Hold on. That's right. Slight <laughs> might be a slight echo. People will be good with it. So no, I think you're right. I think the mindfulness, and obviously we talked about it quite a lot over the last year. It's something I'm, I'm quite conscious of now. So you're right. That is where that does sit with me in the more, yeah, in the moment, taking things in, being able to compartmentalise stuff, appreciate the moments and the little things. So I agree. And it's, you know, it's something I was very sceptical skeptical of about five years ago but i really really believe in now yeah i think that's your spiritual journey right there honestly i You're really believe that's the start of it it's very it's, um, true. definitely for me the meditation was my start of mine and in fact you know we talk about eckhart tolle and, and i'm sort of hang on this one a bit because it can be one of those areas where people think it's a bit it's a bit oh it's a bit religious because i had real hang-ups about religion and if you go back in the podcast you know that I, you know a lot i did lose my mum but we had a discussion about religion didn't we you know it was quite vocal about it, it triggered me quite a lot because I had quite an upbringing with it and I felt it quite controlling. Um, but I'm not saying religion's bad because I think religion can be good and, it's, and it, can, it can help people through difficult times. And I think the spiritual bit is the bit that helps you through those difficult times, that spiritual renewal, whether it's mindfulness, whether it's meditation, whatever works for you. But I think that's a real, like you say, I think that's probably something that's missing but from quite a few people potentially, that spiritual yes. bit, because it can be a feel a little bit, like you say, for people that are probably like yourself, like a little, little bit red and want to go for it and stuff like that can seem a little bit woolly a little bit ooh, bit bit woo woo right it can feel a little bit like that or people can think of it but it's not it really is something that's powerful and and the fact that you said you're quite skeptical about it and then you tried it and it's, it's starting to come i think it just pays homage to it and people like ray dalio swear by meditation tom billiou they swear by meditation and these these people are just massive performers so there's definitely something in it and i think you know, if we're all watching this, it's something we can definitely practice. So, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to tap into that and definitely felt better for doing it. Um, and as I've got older, I've just appreciated things more like watching, you know, looking at the garden, appreciating things, just enjoying that yeah. moment and the things around you and how it all works, how it all works. It's ridiculous how things work, really. Um, but yeah, yeah, I think as, a, as, a, as I say, Lee, I think you are doing that from what you said on the podcast. Yeah. Uh -huh.